Hello, good morning. John Finney from Clark West here. 10 o'clock in the morning and we're up here today and the county fairgrounds. Now, it's only October the 8th. It's a beautiful sunny day. You know, a bit of wind blowing in from behind us. Temperatures should hit probably the mid-70s this afternoon. And if you can believe it, it's actually going to snow here tomorrow. Only in Colorado. Now, temperatures dipping down to about 20 degrees overnight. Bitterly cold indeed. So, what a crazy couple of months it's been for me. You know, I last went out fishing back in August, fished a tournament for Carl, hosted by Tightline Outdoors at Chatfield Reservoir, a nighttime event, and I actually won that one. Much victory coffee was gone soon. After that, sadly I fell ill, and I was off work for almost a month, finally got myself better, and obviously now I'm back out fishing again. I actually went out about a week ago, fished another tournament at Tightline Outdoors, this time at Lake Harbour, and I totally blanked. That's garbage. So today, you know, I thought we'd get out, you know, last really nice sunny day of autumn before the cold weather starts to set in. Got here, got myself set up, saw some carp jumping 25, 30 yards off the bank. So thought I'd get some baits in and get cast out. So today we're fishing with some panko oats packed on both rods and I've got some flavoured strawberry maize popped up with a bit of plastic corn out there as well on both rods. So I'm going to sit back, listen to me alarm go beep beep and hopefully we'll get some carp on the bank soon. Cup West. <sighs> well, almost lunchtime now here at the fairgrounds, and it's time for active coffee. You know, proactive victory coffee doesn't taste as good as victory coffee, but it comes in darn close. So, you know, the carpy action has actually been pretty slow. You know, the sun came out, you know, the wind died down, and really, the carp disappeared. But I did just see a carp swing off the left-hand side, about 20, 25 yards off the bank. So I rolled my left-hand rod back in, baited it up this time with some sculpted flavoured tiger nuts, and cast it back out onto that spot. Right hand rod, still fishing with the story flavoured maize, popped up with a bit of corn, about 25 to 30 yards straight out in front. So, time to carry on drinking the proactive coffee, and hopefully the carp will come. <sighs> Tastes, still pretty good. Well, quarter to one now here at the fairgrounds, and our efforts were finally rewarded. Fist on, fist in the net. Now I saw some sewing fists off to the left and off to the right, recast the rod, took them, and was finally got a fist in. So, this is what we got, fell to the strawberry maze, Look at that, a beautiful Adams County fatty, 21 inches, 16 and a half pounds. I'm going to get this fist back, get cast out and hopefully catch a few more. Come on, Mr. Well, quarter three now here at the fairgrounds and we're in again. Now, I hadn't really seen that much action since that fist was caught about an hour and a half ago and then finally saw a fist jump off to the right, maybe 40 yards off the bank, so I'm really right and rod in. Cast it back out against strawberry flavoured maize, thank God it's back, and we got the job done. And this is what we got a real Adams County bruiser. Look at that 32 inches, 19 pounds, Adams County common carp. What an absolute beauty. Had some holding this fist up, but another one jumped just over my shoulder. What an absolute stunner. And we get this girl back, we've maybe got an hour and a half or so to go. Time for one more fist and one more victory coffee. Quarter past four now here at the fairgrounds, and my fishing is almost done. Now, I was just starting to get ready to pack up, and a quick old run again off the right hand rod, and this was the result. What a great fish to end the session on! Not a monster, but still an absolute beauty. Look at that. Probably 13 14 pound Adam County common carp. What a good little scrapper he was. So, I'm gonna get this fish back, I'm gonna start packing up, call it a day head on home. You know if you enjoyed this video and all the other videos I've made don't forget to subscribe 
and those followers and viewers like you that keep Scarlet West going. But for now, you all have a great evening.